Uh, first of all, thank you very much, the Sakiko Fuda Sensei, and also Osuro University. Yeah, okay, yes. Thank you very much. Uh, uh, just one week ago, uh, we have a Astana uh, Armata 40 conference. Some of them were there. And that, that so many discussions were there uh, regarding UHC, but it's totally different from today. <laughs> it's many, mainly the public health people, but today, is actually, it's, I need more time to digest all such uh, diverse uh, disciplines or multi sectors people's comment and the question, and I really need to talk with each person more deeply. But first of all, thank you very much. It's a very open eye. It's a wonderful opportunity. But uh, my limit, time is limited, but still, I would like to repeat again about Armati Declaration. The declaration, all world leaders committed to health for all through primary health care. And that declaration has value and the principle which a health is a human right, social justice, and solidarity, and recognizing the health is a foundation of development, security, and peace. Mm, still, still it's very touchy. And 2015, uh, many people discuss about SDG, SDG Sustainable Development Goal, but it's the goal, and especially goal three, say that uh, we were uh, all leaders committed to healthy life and well-being for all through universal health coverage. So, but still, uh, we are world facing. Maybe yesterday we uh, somebody introduced that half of the people and not, doesn't have access to essential health services, not like a high tech or. Uh, high technology service is essential service. Half of the population in the world doesn't have access. And every year, 100 million people is uh, down to the poverty because of the out-of-pocket out of payment or expenditure for health. So what we can do for that one? Again, this is a question for me and WHO and for all of you, uh, regardless of what's the discipline you are coming from. And uh, I just would like to say only five issues. Not only five, but it's... Again, we talk about a lot about the politics and the political power, political dynamics, or political origin about the UHC. But uh, again, everybody can agree that the politi political power is very important because to achieve UHC, we need to redistribute the resources from rich to poor, or uh, resources from the and then services from the uh, from the uh, We need to uh, deliver the services and resources to the people who really need the services. So the political uh, power is very important. There's no question, regardless of the unpredictability of the politics somebody mentioned about that time. That's, uh, I just would like to share one good uh, example Re uh, regarding the North Sudan. And North Sudan has uh, some uh, difficulties, uh, some problems. Uh, or democratic issues, everybody, know, many, many people knows about. But one year and two years ago, uh, top of the head of the states and the Minister of Health, Minister of Financing decided to touch UHC. And they, they, their health insurance might, uh, fragmented in each state, but central government centralized one health insurance, one price. Also, uh, medical provider uh, centralized one prices and one um, medical supply fund, they call, and try to increase the coverage. So political will can change. Of course, there are a lot of challenges. Not only that Sudan, and we talk about Kenya, and Kenya that presents a commitment. So let's think about that one. But my second point is the most important thing is how to implement the political uh, translate the political will to the actual action. And uh, for me, I uh, visit several countries uh, that I really would like to emphasize the capacity building of the government officers, especially central government and local government. It's very important, not only the medical professionals or academia people, but the real, real government officers really need the capacity to uh, achieve it. So 
uh, but uh, I learned uh, again, Sudan's medical officer learned ver know very well. Ikigami sensei, Naoki sensei mentioned about Japanese system, but Sudan's officer, director of health, asked the question to me, with, uh, and because I'm originally coming from Japan, why Japan uh, uh, use the fee for service system? Why Japan doesn't introduce the health technology assessment? I mean, that's the question. Uh, uh, they have already run to so, uh, international community with many spaces to run each other. And the third is, is uh, coordination and collaboration with the uh, civil society and uh, uh, multi-sector people who work for the public health. But uh, uh, one positive issue is right now many countries and many international who are right now Minister of Health and the Minister of Health and the Minister Financing Dialogue has already started. Not only, uh, right? So, so many countries, so many international who are both ministers come to work together and discuss it together. So, uh, um, hopefully it works. And fourthly, monitoring, uh, monitoring and evaluation again. I, I'm not talking about, uh, somebody said that's a small cherry picking all issues, but uh, definitely how we could evaluate equity, equality, or how we could evaluate and monitor the quality of the care. Still, there are a lot of spaces to improve. And uh, so having said that, uh, I really expect and ask the researchers to stand up, and there are many, many things can, we can rely on the researchers, especially operational research really need to enhance that's the community level and also country level. So uh, finally, I would like to say that sir, we are facing a big challenges. For example, I always think about income inequality between countries in the world is narrow than the falling in the recent decade. But everybody understands income inequality within countries has been rising. So every country is facing that. So we're facing big challenges. So, but uh, finally, I just encourage uh, some wording with the final panelists. Health, global health is uh, provide opportunity. So the uh, transformation or global, uh, global health is uh, provide us the good opportunity to change the world, then so provide a good platform. I saw. Uh, 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 encouraged and uh, I got the power from that wording. But at the same time, he, I think he said that uh, global health has a responsibility to, do, to change it. So again, so uh, I, uh, as a working um, as a global health arena, together with all of you, uh, uh, we should take our responsibility together, all of you. So thank you very much.